Hi everybody. Um, as I said, I'm going on a trip Sunday through Wednesday to Michigan <clears throat> to see my brother. And I wanted to bring along my traveler's notebooks. If I go camping, I'll take them in an open tote uh, because that works really well. But I didn't feel like for a car trip and staying in hotels that that's what I wanted to do. So I went to... Uh, I was just trying to think what I could do and I went to a Salvation Army thrift store and decided or I think it was Arks Value Village and I saw some purses and I picked up one and I thought well this might work it's kind of a tote like purse and then I saw this and I didn't realize till I got home and checked up what it was what I'd gotten but it's a caboodle they have about a $35 value. It's a plastic, it's a femme fatale, um, is what it's called, the tote. And I paid $4.50 for this. And I just wanna say that it is in perfect condition. There are like no wear, there's no wear inside or outside. It to it's heavy, but it's okay, I'm just carrying it to the car in the hotel and back. But it holds, all four of my main journals that I wanted to take and the supplies. So I'm going to open it and show you what I did. <clears throat> let's open the back first. And in fact, let's just open the whole thing. Here's one. And then if you turn it around, and I stuffed this baby, I'm just going to say. Here's a front pouch. Here's the other pouch. So let's start here. Here's the very front pouch. I won't show that first. I'm going to show you this first. And here's what I put in here. <clears throat> I put my Webster's Color Crush in here with my spirit, all my spiritual. This is my spiritual journal. All my inserts are in here. I put in two of the Tim Holtz Word Packs, Big Chat and Chit Chat. And right here, you can see I've got some cute little stickers I like to use in my, on my calendar and just some tags and things I might use in my journal. This is actually uh, a makeup case and um, it works perfect for this. There's this little pouch right here and I just put in stickers that I like to use all the time in my calendar and some more on the other side. So I'm going to zip that up. It'll be easier. And then here's the other pouch. So let me see. Let's go like this so you can see. Okay. So in here I've got my watercolors, my Windsor Newton Traveling watercolor palette, the half pans which have fallen out. But um, I got this at Michael's, and this is really perfect for traveling. So I have that, and I, with that, I brought along two water uh, brushes. I have two glue types of glue sticks. I've got my little scissors, my tweezers. I have a whiteout tape runner, a little ruler and some sticky double-sided adhesive dots. I think this is Zots brand or by Tombow. So I'm not really sure. So that's in that little pouch. So let me just zip that up. And then back here, this one's really packed, I'm just gonna tell ya. Um, if you look, let me turn it back around. You can see right here I put in, I have a little pencil pouch that has my woodless colored pencils. I'll show you what those look like. Um, uh, <laughs> after I drop them all over creation. So that's what they look like. And I will use those sometimes to color. And I've got some more pens. I have more pens in this one, I'm just telling you. The White Ink Joy and some Artist Loft pens. And a pen from the Typo Store, which is a fun paper and pen store at the Mall of America. So let me turn this back around. And now, 
this is my pencil pouch. I got this at TJ Maxx. And here's all my pencils and highlighters. And I got just tons of them. Well, way more than I really need, but. And then I stuffed in here. This is a carrying case from Creative Memories. And there's a few washies that I really enjoy taking with me. And those are in here. They're the ones I like to use in my journals more than any of my others. And then three journals. <clears throat> I have my regular journal that I just normal journal in, thoughts and such. I have my cheaper, this is really cheap, Michael's Recollections Dream Journal that I do for nature, walks, camping, and travel. So I have it all ready, the page is ready to record the traveling, the trip. And my daily planner, or my workhorse really, because this baby holds all my inserts for planning and thoughts and uh, projects and brain dump and my calendar that uh, is more like a diary that I'd have in here. So, all you do is I just stuff this baby back in here, and I stuff my pencil, my pen case back here. Zip it up. <clears throat> and I am ready to go on my trip. Now, in my purse, I will carry my beloved Foxy Fix passport size. And this has um, my work calendar, my events calendars, uh, lists, my wish lists, my wallet and my, um, the one credit card I, or pay debit card I use, my grocery list, um, this is for money, and just a list for events and one just for general note-taking thoughts brain dump on the go type of stuff and I have a pen that works perfect in here it's a it's a stent um, what do you call that God, the word but anyway for using on digital objects you pull this out here's your pen stick that back in and it's also a flashlight so this, I love, love, love my Foxy Fix. And when I replace that cheap Michaels one, I'm pretty sure it's going to be with a Foxy Fix, their regular st standard size, because I love it so much. But this goes in my purse, my regular purse. So there you go. Um, I like it. If you want to tell me in the comments below what you do for trips, I would love to hear it. And... Um, I'll let you know how this works because I'm taking a trip to Canada and kind of a big round trip to Michigan, Canada, back down through um, New York and Ohio and across back home. So um, I think this is going to come in super handy for that. So thanks everybody.